Amid the darkness Sunday night, six lights hang in Portland's Longfellow Park, one for each victim of the North Street fire. It's been a year. We haven't seen our daughter in a year. I still can't feel, I still can't believe it, I still can't get over it, I still can't accept it. Lou Thomas lost his daughter Ashley that night. He told the crowd of hundreds, we all lost someone. Everybody lost a child that day. Every single person lost a loved one. Everybody that perished in that house had a family. That family stood together, hearing stories about all six. David Bragdon, Jr., Christopher Miles Conley, Nicole Finlay, Ashley Thomas, Melisha Jackson, and Stephen Summers. Their memories very much still alive. Anniversaries are complicated. And so as we mark the passing of one year, it's really important that we are here in this place to remember, to mark this day and this space as sacred. We are one, we are one, we are one. Taking a closer look at what followed after that fire in January, investigators said improperly disposed smoking materials on the porch started the fire and that getting out of the building was impossible because of blocked exits. Investigators also said smoke detectors were not working. The building was demolished in February. In July, a grand jury indicted landlord Gregory Nisbet on six counts of manslaughter. Nisbet was also indicted on four criminal violations of the Life Safety Code. He has pleaded not guilty.